Hi guys, I'm Mighty Balls, and today's video is regarding my mod pack. I've been inundated by emails, messages on World Tanks, messages on YouTube, messages on Twitter regarding is my mod pack ready. It was ready yesterday uh, morning sometime. I just haven't had time to put my video up and let you guys know. But here it is. I'm going to show you exactly what this mod does. There's a couple of new little features which I'll show you. Um, and I'll also show you how to install it if you're new to this mod and you want to know how to install it. So let's show you what's in this mod. First of all, I'll show you the ping. It shows you the EU1, EU2 ping or Russian if you're in the Russian ones. The reason for that is because sometimes if you have a look here, it shows you that it's 163 ping where it actually isn't. Next up, we've got the lock for the gold as well as the uh, experience so you're not spending your hard earned gold on rubbish. It's a durable carousel as you can see. Uh, this will be changed in the next patch, it will be coming as default, so I won't be introducing this. As you can see, you've also got your masteries on each of your vehicles, and if you hover over it, it gives you the full spec of the vehicle, including the gun elevation and depression, etc. So if you go over to the service record, it automatically goes onto your vehicles, it shows you your WNA, and it shows you your efficiency. It's also all colour-coded, as you can see, which makes it look a little bit prettier. So if you press the G key, the map's returned where it pings into the middle of the screen and you can press it and if you press the, the G key again it goes away. On the top left you've got your players panel where you've got all your four little stages. I always have mine on that one. You've got your overall uh, games played, overall win rate and overall W8. If you press the tab key you'll see the, how many games they've played in that tank they're in right now. What the win rate is in that tank right now and also what their damage, average damage is in that tank. You have a hitbox here which will come later, which we'll see. You've got a blocked panel as well as a live W and 8 counter. If you press the Alt key, you'll see that you've got your damage of each member on your team. And then you've got your high caliber in the top as well as your actual team, uh, what your team damages and what their team health is, sorry, not damage. <laughs> I do apologize guys also you'll notice my lovely balls showing in the middle of your face right there <laughs> every time you're spotted I'm sure you guys are gonna love that <laughs> and as you can see in the bottom left hand corner you've got how much you got hit by what you got hit by and who you got hit by as well as you've got a load counter of what their load time is now the problem with that, it doesn't take in brother in arms, it doesn't take in 100% crew, it doesn't take in gun ram events, anything like that. It is just standard with a 75% crew, so take that with a pinch of salt guys. So focusing back onto the hit counter again, I'm going to take a shot at this Yegru, as you can see. I pen him, I don't know how, but in the top left you'll notice that it tells you your overall damage, damage for that tank, damage you've totally taken that for that tank and which tank it is. It also gives you your experience for your tank and experience what your crew members had. So when you click that button you'll have your session stat which just tells you everything you've done. For instance it has my last game there, I've only played one game today. But it gives you your total, your damage, your hit rate etc. And if you click on the tanks it'll tell you individual tank what your W8 is for the day. So all that's left to show in this video is basically where you can download it and how to install it. First of all, you've got to go over to the XVM website, which is www.modxvm.com.en. You've got to log in where the logout button is. Activate and update, guys, just in case. Then you head over to my website, which is www.mightyballs.website. When you get to here, this website here, you click on the menu tab in the top right and then you click on my mod pack so if you click on that it will take you to the mod pack page which basically just shows you everything about the mod itself gives you a little video where this one will be and shows you the actual version it runs at so this one's 9.15.2 which is the latest one then you just simply click the download button so let's show you how to install this 
So you download it as you can see here, right click, extract all, and you'll see it on the, on extracting now, extracting, whatever. <laughs> so you double click, you can see there, some, that's a bug on some windows, some windows you'll see that, but it should just say ResMod, just double click into it and you'll see the ResMod folder. Now you need to open up your World of Tanks folder, I've got mine under a quick one right there. So find your World of Tanks folder, normally it's under your local disk and then in your games folder. Um, which you can see right there and then into your games folder. Mine's on the E because this is my dedicated gaming drive. So you need to delete that ResMod folder, so just click it once, click delete, accept that you need it deleting and then just simply drag over the mod over to there and then that's done guys so that's it for this video guys if you liked the video or shall I say if you like the mod pack please like and subscribe because it won't just help this video it'll help my channel guys so I'll see you next time